Hey guys, Grass on here, playing more uh, Antimatter Dimensions. I just discovered something. You know this max button? You know when you click it a bunch, the message pops up? Like the blue thing? Oh, you're supposed to hold it down, not to tap it. Well, I want to show you. So you see my uh, current fastest infinity, I, you only switch. So basically, I want you to watch this, okay? You see the normal speed everything's going at? Holding it. So again, normal speed like this. Holding it. Anyone notice anything? Normal speed. Holding it. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna get us to like the point point where I buy a galaxy. And I'm gonna get get to a point where I can show you really well. Okay. Even just here. Okay. Normal. Holding it. Does anyone notice anything about this? You know, like, maybe the fact that it's, like, going, uh, bil what, a billion times faster? It's going so fastly. Look at that infinity percent rise. Look at that. Bam, all the way up. Get the first, the, get the galaxy. Now just keep going. Get that one. Next boost. That boost. Another one. That gives us seven. Then, and crunch. Currently, my fastest infinity is one minute and seventeen seconds. Which means... I'm passively getting... Where does it say? I'm getting an every twelve minutes and fifty-three seconds. So every just under thirteen minutes, I'm getting an infinity point now. So I could literally come back in just a few hours and be able to get this next next thing. For 300 points? Like, if I'm getting one every, like, 12 minutes? Let's say I can get it down to 10 minutes. Which would be, like, a one-minute infinity, which is, like, kind of not probably not possible. But if I could get it down to one minute, then what happens? Um, I'm getting 60 an hour, and it would only take five hours to actually get that. No. 10 minutes. I'd be getting six, six per hour, and it would take 50 hours, so only two days. So that passive is, I think I, I already have the passive now. So now I can just wait. Why didn't you guys tell me this max button does something? Holding it is so much more powerful. Like the speed at which everything's going. Why didn't you tell me this was here? Like, this is insane. It just... It goes up so fast now. I'm making like so many infinity points. I think I can beat my fastest time as well. If I actually focus on this next one. I can use two fingers. Okay, here we go. Okay, I'm holding the max. There we go. Keep going. I'll get that just to boost us up. Just super quick. There's the galaxy. There's that. There's two. There's three. Four, they're all unlocked now. And then just goes all the way up. And crunch. How fast was that? Forever isn't that long, an achievement. Forever isn't that long. Infinity in one minute or less. Start with 50 billion antimatter. That changes... That does nothing. One every nine minutes and 25 seconds. 
fastest infinity was fi was 56 seconds. That was only 56 seconds. This next one will obviously be slower because I've been waiting here a while, but... That's insane. Um, as for challenges as well, I beat the 5th and 6th challenges. I didn't beat that 8th one yet like I wanted to. I tried it, but I ended up like, getting softlocked because it just took too long. I could try the 7th one. The multiplier from buying 10 antimatter dimensions reduced to times 1, but increased by time that much for up to a maximum, whatever. Okay, let's do it. So now is the max button doing anything now? I think it only increases things for like the dimension boost stuff. Or something to do that. Anyway, I'm still holding it, so this is gonna be like, su this is still gonna go super quick. 100 sextillion. Get one and then continue. Okay, now we need a non -alien. There we go. Now we're just speeding up super fast. We're already at 12%. Faster. So I think the max button only works off like boosts or something. Why didn't you guys tell me this was here sooner? Like, in the, in the seven minutes I've been recording, I've already hit infinity, like, how many times now? And I'm about to, like, super speed through a challenge. I'm about to beat this entire challenge on camera. Why were you keeping this from me? You monsters. This is so much easier. There's the galaxy. Yeah, because it doesn't, like, seem to do anything here. Yeah, it's not doing anything now. But now I can tell it's affecting. So it seems to only affect, like, once the boosts come into place. 42%, we already got the one galaxy. One galaxy and, like, seven boosts is usually enough. Might need more now, because the challenge is, like, putting on some restriction I didn't bother to look at. What was the restriction again? I don't think it's mattered. It's like the, the 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 multipliers are weird. They're like start lower. This changes almost nothing because I've got my dimension boost in the max button. Get the tenth, and that's the challenge done. Normal challenge seven is ready to complete. Crunch. Let's get another one. I think we can speed run again. I did accidentally take my finger off the max buttons. This might not work. Why did the devs even add this into the game? Like, sure, it maybe makes it more like fun, but like, kind of takes away like. All the, I guess it like makes you a much bigger incentive to be like active in the game. The world just collapsed due to excess antimatter. Why do I have to? Why do I? Why, why do I have to hit like a manual crunch button now? Is that because that one achievement, if I started getting them too fast? I need an automatic cruncher. For 300, you start with an antimatter gap. Every reset with- you start every reset with four dimension boosts, automatically unlocking the eighth dimension, and you start with an antimatter galaxy. That's gonna be really powerful. Cause that basically means I only have to go to the- I only have to do the boosts. Of course, then I need to actually start, like... Oh, here we go. Big Crunch Auto Buyer. Each antimatter dimension produces the antimatter two below it. First antimatter anti anti dimension produces reduced. Sure, let's do it. 
Max button doesn't do anything right now, so I have to wait for the first one. Oh god, this is slow. It's somewhat speeding up. Well, maybe. I'm waiting for just one trillion. Up uh, second trillion. Hit that dimension boost and hold the max button. There we go. Now it'll go significantly faster. Until I buy that one galaxy, which is... And then it'll start slowing down again. <laughs> just imagine some, like, music in the background. Can I, is there, like... Can I, like, get some, like... What kind of music is not copyrighted? Isn't most game music not copyrightable? Like, am I allowed to get, like, the Final Fantasy music in the background looping? I don't know. I know there's, like, some of that free music, um... It's still going kind of slow, even with the boost. Which isn't doing much right now, I don't think. Still waiting for the 100 quadrillion. And that first thing's gonna get automatically. You know, I, I'm gonna turn off the auto buyer. Toggle all auto, auto buyers. Hmm? Excuse me? They're all off. Well, now it's going faster, at least, with the second dimension boost. Now I can guarantee it's going faster, because I saw it speed up. So if it's producing the one two below it, that means the six isn't producing the fifth, which makes every it slows everything down. It's like two... The reds are producing reds, and the blacks are producing blacks. So it's like two individual trails. Nothing's actually overlapping, so it, it really slows down the exponential. It's like as though you only had four dimensions. Of course, I have the max button, so it doesn't really matter. Because the max button's easily making up for it. Well, I don't know. Maybe it's it's definitely, it's not making up for it, but it's helping. Helping offset the problems. Waiting for one non million now. Getting close, we're at septillion now, we need, we only need one non-alien, so we just need the to go through the octillions. Hit ten soon. There we go. Probably gonna go, some, go play some, like, some chess after this, then hop in the hot tub. Didn't really play any, like, video games today. No, no Hollow Knight or Skyrim or Minecraft. Nothing on the PS4. Just phone stuff. I have some math homework yet. I still have to do later as well. Okay, pick up that and that. Now we can get the 8th dimension, which I think helps. So we're still waiting for more boosts. Once we get the galaxy, the whole thing is going to reset and take, a, take forever again. I think we can still beat this challenge within the... I think we can beat the challenge, um, today, in the video. Oh yeah, and it's 2.5 times multiplier now, because I have a whole bunch of these, um, where are the upgrades? I have all these, I have all these ones now. So you can see what they are. Um, so just these four, starting with the boosts. I, I have 10 out of 20 I need. And then I can start with the, then I start with the fifth dimension. And the ability to, like, have the max trigger sooner, I guess. I can do the, uh, sacrifice as well if I need to speed it up more. Uh, 
mean, 41. Let's see, 84. Multiply by almost 2. Still taking a while. Getting closer, 81, 82, 83, 1 of those and that's all we need. We're only one quarter of the exponential way. I don't think I can just keep buying boosts, I think I need at least one galaxy to be able to complete this challenge. I smell smoke. Is it my phone? How hot's my phone? My phone's not too hot. It's gone suddenly. Weird, maybe, maybe it's like coming from outside. Maybe it just has a brief thing that came from outside. This max button's like really helping. I'm still kind of wondering if it's like a placebo, placebo or something, but... If I tap really fast, will it message come again? No. That percentage is still climbing very slowly. We're almost at uh, 99. We're almost there. We're not going to be able to complete this challenge today, but I'll, I will complete it offline. Okay, I think this is where I'll end the video. I'm going to leave this to go, I'm going to go do something else, and I'll come back and I'll be able to get the, the galaxy, and I'll keep playing manually to get the dimension boost afterwards. So I'll leave this to I'll leave this to its own thing, and I'll come back and get the galaxy, and then I'll finish up the boosts. Um, and then I'll complete this challenge, and then I'll get a big crunch auto buyer. And then next video, it's, it'll, next video we'll probably be doing, like, I'll have all the challenge, I'll have all, like, the upgrades done, we'll be looking at, like, I'll be finishing the next the challenges. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed, remember if you enjoyed my content, feel free to like and subscribe. I think, like, Eternities are coming after Infinities or something. I'm not exactly sure what's coming next, but... I mean, this game's interesting. Um, this game's fun. Good, good idle game. Kind of have to be, like, here to make it work, though, because you have to keep buying the stuff to make it go automatically. Um, but anyway, yeah. Hope you enjoyed. Remember, if you enjoy my content, feel free to like and subscribe. I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.